matapos makuha ni Pacman ang pang-anim na dibisyon, ay sinubok muli ni Pacman ang kanyang kakayahan kung kaya ba niyang maging kampiyon sa pitong dibisyon. Subalit para magawa ito ay kinailangan ni Pacman umakyat ng timbang para makuha ang gusto nito. Ngunit sa pagtungtong niya ng welterweight division ay naando ng boksingerong pinaghaharian ang welterweight division. At yun nga ay ang Puerto Rican na si Miguel Cotto, isang legendary fighter na parang tigre pag nasa loob na ng lona. Subalit walang takot itong kinaharap ni Pacman. Si Cotto ay may record na 34 wins with 27 knockouts. At may isang talo lamang. Subalit ang isang talo na ito ni Cotto ay mula kay Antonio Margarito noong 2008. Na kung saan ay dinaya siya nito at naging kontrobersyal pa nga ito. Kaya wala pang boxer na nagbigay ng malinis na pagkatalo sa champion na ito. At bago nga nito makaharap si Pacman ay in underestimate nito ang Pinoy. Ngunit walang takot si Pacman na pasukin ng lungga nang naghahari-hari ang champion kaya isa ang magandang laban na ito na inabangan ng mga boxing fans halina't balikan natin kung paano nilabanan ni Pacman ang kinatatakutang champion He's a precise puncher. And now we're seeing some of that speed, though, of Pacquiao beginning to make a little bit of a difference for him. You're right, Rich. I think he had to adjust to the strength of Cotto, and he had to realize that he could hang in there. And now he's able to set a little more into his plan. Let's see if they'll hang in there. This is a red-hot round, guys. Cotto's had his moments. He goes southpaw. Covers up. Where's that switch? He doesn't do it a lot. He's a natural left-hander. Body head. But the body really landed. For Cotto, back comes Pacquiao. Stinging combination. Do you love it? Love it. Big combination, big hook by Cotto. Cotto's the guy. Chris Yeah, if he could time him. And he's done a good job. But here comes lightning combination from Pacquiao. And Pacquiao moving forward for the first time in the third round. Beautiful counter shot by Pacquiao. Yeah, here comes oh. Angles. And that's a goal, a bad, bad break for the champion. But it is a knockdown. It, it is a knockdown. Seven. Seven. Woo. Eight. Okay. Is he hurt? Did he get slipped? Is Manny going to try to close it out big? Could be very dangerous for him. Here comes Pacquiao coming forward. He's off the jab now. Pacquiao's in front of him. Taking the lead here. Driving the champion back, but here comes Cotto Southpaw again. Cotto's been down. Now he's bullying Pacquiao there. That's the right thing for him to do, which he shouldered him off. Oh, he oh, runs into the hook, Pacquiao. But the champion retreats and resets. But I'll tell you, I like the speed of Cotto. He doesn't look so slow. Cotto does not look slow at all. He seemed to match him with counter punches, and Pacquiao cannot get overconfident and think he has his man. Hurt and at the point where he's going to go for the knockout, but, but, oh, but this is so him. huge if it's a 10 8 round for Pacquiao. Cotto with a hook. 
Pacquiao comes up with air. Cotto bites down with more power shots. A lot of those Pacquiao punches missing. We should remember, too, that Miguel Cotto is a guy who has been shaken in fights. He has been knocked down, like by Ricardo Torres. He knows how to get up and win. Yeah, he's more like which, Eric Morales. Which, uh, Mar yeah, which Mario said, right. He's much more aggressive. So this is a different kind of a uh, boatload for Manny Pacquiao to handle. Pacquiao turning, turning back. Perfect. And a nice body shot by Pacquiao as well. Whoa, that's textbook. But he does you want to get into a slugfest with him. Cotto wants to make it a war, it looks like. Left hook lands from Cotto, and now they're slugging it. And much has been made, Nick, of Cotto's body attack, but Pacquiao himself has a great body attack, and it's his punches come so fast, it's very hard to see. Wow, that was a beautiful, beautiful two-way action bit. It's deafening in here, and you've got 17,000 on their feet. It was a close round, guys. Manny's rounds are clicking on like the two-minute round. And I didn't think I'd see Manny be just resting on the, on the ropes. Manny's been driven back at times, but here he comes forward. Boy, it flashes of brilliance in this round. Turning, turning, Cotto, running him into shots. Cotto's left-handed now, trying to tee off with that left hand. Now he's back orthodox. And he can switch because he's a natural south. Oh, nice, nice movement from Cotto to avoid those oh. shots. And he's down again. Combination puts him down. He's hurt this time. He's very wobbly. I'm watching his legs. He's trying to get his legs back. He is very wobbly. He's been down twice. He'll get saved by the bell, it seems. Maybe. Maybe. Exactly right, Rich. And he's abandoned going to the body, which, which really slowed him down, I thought, in the round that he got the knockdown. That remains to be seen. We'll see. Down. If it goes later, Mario. It's true, Nick. And the five ready. But he is fighting a southpaw and hasn't been effective changing over, trying to land that left from the southpaw position just to close distance. Pacquiao having a better round than Cotto here, don't you think? Oh, yeah, it's been, he's been active this round. I thought he kind of took that last round off. A lot of steam has been taken from Cotto, and he's been very good recently, Rich, at, at, at making adjustments and doing what he has to do to win. Oh, oh he got hit flush. Flush on the left chin. hand. And Pacquiao's holding on to him. And possibly, oh, and big shot by Cotto. is breathing with his mouth wide open. And that's like dramatically. Yeah, that's a fight. Fight. Here can retreat. He's on the ropes now. And Pacquiao with three shots after three shots. The fast, bigger guy. And the role's been reversed as far as the aggressor getting against the ropes. Oh, Cotto, yes. That's a good point. I think Cotto got Here stunned. He got Here he comes. I saw him back off, and I saw a little look on his face. Yes. His nose is really bleeding now. Cotto's face so much. Pacquiao is zeroing in now. All about aggression is to turn it. Pacquiao's work rate has been so measured. Oh, and the, now the champion absorbing. It could turn into a systematic beating unless the champion could turn things around. Oh. And now he's wobbled badly and holding on. He's trying to get his legs. He's on the ropes. Oh, and a big combination by Miguel. Wait a oh, yeah, but this champion. is a beatdown now, Mario. It is. It's systematic. Pacquiao. Looking for the Eve. Miguel would like to start something with a big, that big left hook of his. He's it's almost like a matador waiting for the bull to yep. slow down for the final slow. He's tired of running. And we'll go to the corners and see. I get a, it appears so. Well, he didn't get and he gathered himself a bit. Trying to pick a spot. Well, look, Pacquiao fighting him when he wants, coasting when he wants. It's all him. Still strong. And the crowd just waiting for an end, you know, for an end. For the flurry of the punch that ends it. At dito naman sa uling round, 
Makikita na magang magana ang mukha ni Koto. Hindi akalay na ang tagline niyang lakas ay hinigitan pa ni Pacman. Kung dati ay siyang tigre sa loob ng lona, ngayon ay nakatapat siya ng mabangis na leon. Hanggang sa itinigil na ng referee ang laban dahil kita na naman na hindi na nito kakayanin pa. At nanalo nga si Pacman by technical lockout at nakuha ang WBO Walter White Belt. So hanggang dito na lang po tayo mga idol at kung nagustuhan mo naman ang ating video huwag kalamutang mag like at pindutin mo na din ang subscribe button and hit the bell icon for more boxing updates.